All the birds are busy. Stay this way, please. The church is close now. George's Museum for the young and less young. Local museum, exceptional summer event. Meet No-No the robot and take part in his treasure hunt. I don't see much. Let's walk with caution. I have a feeling that we can win gifts and they arrive right in this vase. Nineteen ninety. Inauguration always up to new challenges. The museum is facing the power supply issues of St. Exel. George electrically autonomized his museum. So you're Nico the robot. You don't seem super friendly for something made to amuse kids. Still, he and the museum look shut down for now. I think I'm going to need a lever. I think I'm going to need a lever. Cycle. At least, if you don't understand what's in front of you, it probably means you are facing modern art. on one of the highest points of St. Exel. The Assumption Church was built against this panorama has become an emblematic place for those who like to observe the flora and wildlife of the region. Finally got there. 
St. Exel Church. Let's find what this church has in store for me. Today a reader, tomorrow a leader. They well, made sure to enjoy today. <laughs> That's one elaborate sundial. Despite its look, I'm sure people can still use it. But I have a watch. It won't open from this side. No doubt I'm on the right storage room. I am gonna need a key for this one. This setup looks recent. They probably did it just before the attack on the- Okay, have some courage, Elise. Transept. It's locked. Tomb of Father Rowalt, abbot who watched over the population of St. Exel. He dedicated his life to the village and the population. He distinguished himself in particular by his taste for religious, spiritual, and cultural texts. The large library of the Assumption Church is in his image. Shit. What are they doing here? I'm not sure I really want to know. Cemetery. Never open that one. It has been condemned by the sect. I could never open that one. been revealed to me. I understand why the most basic things, like having babies, has been taken from us. Our divinity that required so much sacrifice is still not content. The village kids have had it easy for too long. They need to share our burden. It's talked to me and asked to surrender them to its will. Generations have forgotten how this village was built. It is time for a history lesson. We placed statues to display each person we sent to see. In their anonymity, they remind us of the road still to be endured. But be reassured, my devotees, this road is coming to an end. 
I found a way to communicate with our protector. It has chosen me as its vessel and talked to me so many times. I will finally be able to answer. A few of us were meeting secretly in preparation for our next and last action. It will all be revealed to you tonight after the festivities. Do not enter the crypt yet. I have the answers you have all been looking for. I will remove this poison from our life. This staging was prepared while the population was at the festivities. The population of St. Exel being already fried, I dare to imagine the trauma of people if they had been exposed to this. And of course, served with its complimentary tape. bright and colorful sphere in this village. When I approach it, I start feeling like I'm being transported to a totally surreal world. Vegetable garden and scriptorium. World. A blinding world. Rather calm, in which the water can go up the waterfalls. Like these columns of water. Have you seen them too? Compared to the daily grind, it's a rather pleasant world to sink in. It feels quite cold though. In this dreamlike environment, I walk through Greek and Roman vestige, just like those we saw on our trips before moving to the coast. I have the feeling of being constantly exposed to things that we experienced in the past. It allows me to cling into many memories of our arrival in St. Exel, and all the events that took place before I was left alone here. Strangely, I have the feeling that time no longer passes when I find myself in this alternate world. It must have taken a lot of time to set up all this staging. A lot of struggling souls probably joined the devotees over time. Am I imagining this? Am I starting to daydream? Am I totally crazy? A sheet is hidden under this pile of books. Father, I have heard noises coming from the crypt several times. Isn't the crypt supposed to be unlocked only once a year? The door is locked up tight when I want to access it. Residents of Saint-Exil, I observe you, and I see great suffering in you. You are- Hmm, interesting. This book traces the entire history of the church and the creation. I'll take it with me for my bedtime reading. This church seems to hide a lot of secrets from me. Yet, you persist in not wanting to acknowledge it. The situation here has been deteriorating for years, and no one has come up with solutions to your problems. No one wants to face it, but our village is sick at heart. Here and there, some think that a curse has befallen our lands. Well, these people were right. Crypt. This door seems locked by a complex mechanism. This place has a soul. If you've lived here long enough, you've definitely felt it shining through its walls, trees, and cobblestones. At least you could feel it. Something has changed, and it has for too long. A dark and silent poison proliferates in the veins formed by our alleys and ends up washing up at the foot of our doors contaminating us a little more each day. Saint-Exil is not just a village. Vegetable garden and scriptorium. And its creation is no- This door can be unlocked from the other side. No accident. The ancients never doubted it. Someone, or rather something, greater than us, decided to gather us here a long time ago. He made us build this village and protected our ancestors in ex Organ and Bell Tower. Chain for his benevolence. Some of us honor him for that. It is the same entity which today has decided to call you to order and punish you. 
Unlike you, I never doubted its existence and its great power. It shows me... The annual High Mass is still maintained for the day. Like previous years, we are expecting the sect had chosen the right place and the right time to strike a blow. ...to guide you like a shepherd bathed in the light of his wisdom. Join us so that this nightmare finally ends. From now on, you are aware and cannot go back. If you don't bend to his will, you'll end up paying for it. Only one possible solution is offered. Tomb of the Duro family. Family who contributed greatly to the creation. The fishing activity was so important that the family built their house at the end of the Keys. They thus were the first informed of the contents of the merchant's cargoes in St. Axel. To you. An envied position. Obey. The De Vigno Mausoleum. They played an important part in the de This family was in charge of the local agriculture. They ult the flower house was once their home, but it is now owned by the town. The Angel and the Newborn, Unknown Artist. This statue is incredible. I could never open that one. Tomb of Father Rowalt. He distinguished himself in particular. The large library of the Assumption Church is in his image. Organ and Bell Tower. I am gonna need a key for this one. St. Exel also has its little jokers who come to tag everything they find. Excellent. Bulletin from the city of St. Axel. The structure has been weakened and water can infiltrate the wall. The town will start the repairs soon so they can avoid a- Doesn't look like they had time. Planks removed. This should weaken this son of a brick.
There are no bad moments to officialize a bond. I could move faster with such a bike, but with these ghosts on the road, I really wouldn't be discreet. Cemetery. It has been condemned by the sect. Both knew you couldn't resist me. Snow and rain? Not a good mix. Completely locked. Certainly not done with the place. I'm a living experiment on sugar.
have to go to this crypt. I feel that I am close to the goal. Ahead, Boisseau left, St. Exel's Church. We both knew you couldn't resist me. We both knew you couldn't resist me. Completely locked. I'm gonna need a key for this one. The Assumption Memorial Cross. It was created in honor of the- Looking more closely at the cross, one has the impression that some parts can be interlocked on the sides. This key will allow me to explore the church a little more. I've seen the same kind of lock around. growth experiment do not touch with your hands can induce dreamlike experiences
The ornithologist observed the behavior of the birds in contact with these weird rocks. Note for the ornithologist experimenting in our vegetable garden. We are happy to lend you a corner of the garden, but please do not occupy. Your birds seem to go completely crazy inside their cages. I've taken it upon myself to release them. A lot of activity probably took place here, but it quickly became dismal once the monks had left. It must have taken a hell of a lot of wood to heat this building. I wonder if they spent more time chopping wood or reading. Woodcutter monks. Nothing. Let's find you a place back on that cross. Tomb of the, the White Man, an ingenious system initially developed for its moats, made it possible to send water to different parts of the village. I have nothing to put on that cross now.
organ and bell tower. Too many people have access to this damn bell tower, so the craftsman installed a system for me. Since I'm the only one who knows about music, you'll all have to go through me. Well, I'm going to need to learn the organ to continue upstairs. If I'm good enough, I'll make a duet with Pierre. This door seems locked by a complex mechanism. Hello, Francois. I heard the cult vandalized your property. You have my full support in this ordeal. Glad the storage room is useful to someone here. Leave your things there as long as necessary. P.S. Regarding the flower house garden door, the mayor gave me the handle they used to unlock it. I left it here. During the night from Saturday to Sunday, the property of the presbytery was degraded by the people claiming to be devotees. Given the amount of the damage, the town of St. Exel made the flower house available to its own- They probably wanted to intimidate him. Or to keep him quiet. Push it now. Now the system should be unlocked. George, with the momentary- I wanted to reactivate it. In the meantime, the museum will remain in the dark. So, 
The wind turbines providing him with power stopped working. I wonder where they are. Snow and rain? Not a good mix. This computer? It's in the lighthouse too. Enter coordinates. What coordinates? What are you doing here? Is that a message for them? Are they using these antennas? It was really so perific, but I managed to finish the book found in the church. There is a lot of information about this place and the village in general. It's sad, but it wasn't such a bad evening in comparison. If we go back many centuries, St. Exel experienced a much more sumptuous period. Originally, this village was only a small fishing hamlet by the sea, but it was located on the only road between two larger villages on the coast. It is with the cooperation of four great figures that the village developed and experienced its greatest activity, the Vinios, who ensured the agricultural activity of the village, the Deralt family, 
who were dedicated to fishing activities, the Duc de Bliard, who ensured the defense of the village with his soldiers, and finally the Abbot Royo, in charge of the spirituality through its church. Thanks to the progress brought by this collaboration, St. Exel had been able to develop for a hundred years. But, sadly, during the following centuries, the village did not, All right. not know the destiny that we imagined, and this prosperity turned into a distant memory. In remembrance of this period, which still resonates until today, these personalities were honored with the presence of a tomb that are located in the north. So this puzzle and win a coin to use in George workshop. Thick and in the transept of the church. They also built a cross at the end of the flower house once belonged to the Vinio family, which played a leading role in local agriculture. The basement illustrating the former activities of the an ingenious controllable water supply system of the White Manor made it possible to supply the property if necessary. There is a receptacle for four plates, each illustrating one of the families. Once a year, these plaques are gathered and placed on the cross to allow the inhabitants of St. Ran out of battery a long time ago. It makes this whole house seem stuck in time. Commemoration for its history and its ancestors. I swear, officer, it's not a break-in. The back door was open. Someone left a tape. Journaling is not just for grown-ups. Dad, science we are moving again. The electrician came to change the old teacher's coat in the basement. Because you weren't there, he asked me for a coat and I want to play a game. You never play with me, so now... You will have to find the answer all by yourself. It's a four-digit code. The first is the hour on the living room clock, the one you never replaced the batteries for. Then I've put the minute. And then I've put the number of boat sales in the house. Have fun! 